feels like rendezvous You know what to do Keep your love for me only I get high on you yeah, yeah. Hi guys! <coughs> That's a cute entrance. Hey guys. Um, so I am currently waiting for my passport to be processed. It's a long process. It's currently 9.57. It won't be done until 2.30. So I brought my makeup bag with me. So I'm going to try to get ready with you guys in the car. I don't know. I figured this could be a cool video, different video, kind of vlog style, kind of different. If you have to do your makeup in a rush or in the car, this is what you could do. Um, so basically everything I have are like my essentials. Like what the only thing I would take if I had to get, do my makeup like somewhere without a lot of time or like without a lot of space to carry a lot of stuff. So um, this is like a Clinique travel bag. I mean, it's pretty big. Um, it's the one I'm gonna be taking on vacation with me. I can fit a lot in here. But I figured I would just do my makeup with you guys. So I'm going to spray my face with the Cover FX setting spray first. Because my skin is a little dry and I forgot moisturizer. So I'll give my skin a little moisture. Hoping that the lighting is okay. I mean, we are, we're in a car, so I don't know. But I'm going to prime my skin with the Porefessional... The professional by benefit i love this primer it's like one of my oldies but goodies it's so amazing at filling pores i'm also using the viewfinder as a mirror right now i usually get ready for work in my car every day when i used to work like far or early in the morning like when i was in high school i used to work at the mall um, that was like my first job and it wouldn't be early cause I was at high school, but like I'd be rushing back from like school to my job. Um, and so I would like always pack makeup in my bag so that I could just get ready in the car. So I always get ready in the car, just something I did for a while. The foundation I've been loving is the Naked Skin by Urban Decay Weightless Ultra Def Liquid Makeup. I really like this foundation, although I already need a darker shade. This is in 4.5. And it's okay, but I think I need like a shade or two darker. That was actually not a bad experience in there. I was like a little anxious about it because it's an hour away from my job. I, I mean, from my job. It's an hour away from my house and I was running late to begin with. So I was like, fuck, like they're not gonna be able to take me. I wasn't even running late. There was a 40 minute accident on the highway. like. Like, it was a 40-minute delay on the highway, so I was like, fuck. I left my house at 6.30 this morning. My appointment was at 8.30, so I technically should have had an extra hour, like, for all of that. But it still ended up not being enough. I was a half an hour late, but it was, it was totally fine. I didn't know that you could go there without an appointment, because online, even on the door, it says appointment only, but people were going in there, and they were, like, letting them in, so it was fine. I'm like so excited for vacation though. Now we're leaving in two days and it feels so real now. Like when I didn't have my passport, I was kind of like, shit, like, are we going to be able to go? But now that I know that you can get it in one day and I'm getting it, I feel so much more like relieved and ready to go. I'm so excited. I have to pack tonight. And then tomorrow I have a 10 o'clock nail appointment. And then... I'm just going to clean the house and pack and buy a couple of groceries because I think my brother's going to stay at my house to watch the babies. Um, so I'm just going to buy him some groceries so that he doesn't have to worry about that because I was going to like clear out my fridge because we're going away for a week. So like any food that we did have was going to be bad by the time I got back. Um, but he doesn't really cook. So I'm just going to buy him like boxes of mac and cheese and like cold cut. Oh no, he can't eat cold cuts. I don't know. Pasta salad. Just stuff that he can take to work because my mom usually makes his lunch so did you see what i mean it just it's so flawless it just is such a good foundation it looks so pretty but after i'm done i'm gonna go find a starbucks so i can edit and um just like chill and get a drink and chill for a while my cousin is off of work at 11 so 
Honestly, I may just stay here. Because it's already 10.04. By the time I'm done with my makeup, it's probably going to be like 10.20. So maybe I'll just stay here. I don't know. I already ran out of my Makeup Revolution concealer. So the only bad thing about that is like you don't get a lot of it. So I actually should go to Ulta tomorrow or today at some point and pick up like a little concealer for travel. Because this one's running low. That was the Tarte Sheep Tape in the color Light Neutral. And then... I'm gonna go over like the inner portions of my eye where I have the most darkness with the lighter shade. So just here. I have a lot of discoloration on my eyes. And then, you know how I like to let that sit on my skin for a little bit. But I'll dab this one in. I wonder if there's an Ulta around here. That could pass time. There's a mall, but I think they have a Sephora. And the good thing about eyelash extensions is like, I don't have to worry about piling on mascara or a fault bringing like falsies with me. That's such a pain in the ass, especially for the Dominican Republic. Like it's gonna be so humid and so hot. My mom just texted me. She's like, I FaceTimed you by accident. She's always butt dialing people. But yeah, eyelash extensions are so convenient for like travel or if you work a lot of hours or like early in the morning or you work at all <laughs> and you don't feel like putting a strip lash on or piling your mascara on there's nothing like a beauty blender to blend out your under eyes i swear i've tried doing it with a brush too but ever since i discovered the beauty blender like i can't there's no other way you just don't get the same finish this left, I mean, this right eye has been creasing so bad lately, and I don't know why. It's just that one eye, and it's, like, creasing on me. You know, I had to bring my airspun powder. I cannot set my under eyes with anything but airspun. This is a little messy, but well worth it. There's just nothing like this powder either for me. Just a must have. And then whatever's left in my cap, I'm just gonna swirl on my face. It's not much. Just to lock this in place, cause it is hot today. For us at least. I already like looked up the weather too for the place for, for for DR. I think we're going to Puerto Plata and the weather looks beautiful. So I'm excited. Okay, for bronzer lately I've been ew. For bronzer lately I've been going back to this pure cosmetics bronze and brighten palette and just using the bronzer out of it. It's just like a pretty shimmery bronzer for the summer. I always go a little overboard with the bronzer and blush, but I'm gonna pat it out, don't worry. Henrik's so funny, like he still won't, even though I know about the trip, he won't tell me about, he won't tell me like where we're staying, like the resort we're staying, or anything, cause he wants to like keep a little bit of a surprise. He had to tell me, cause literally otherwise I would not be able to leave the country without my passport, but. Bronzers on, I'm gonna do my eyebrows now. I'm gonna use the Maybelline Brow Drama in the front of my brows. I need more of this too, I'm out. Oh, there's a giant dragonfly by my car. Okay, they have so kindly started to jackhammer the road behind me, so I hope you can't hear that. I'm sure you can though. But I am filling in my eyebrows now with the powder by the Brow Gal. Okay, brows are on. I'm just gonna fluff through them a little. And then I'm gonna set them, um, did I bring my clear brow gel? I don't know, I feel like I did, maybe not. Yes, I did, with my brow gel clear gel. 
water resistant. All right, now we're gonna do some blush. I brought my whole NARS palette. I'm gonna be using the shade Luster, which is just that like apricot shade there. I love it, it's so pretty. Okay. I hope you guys can see this. <laughs> that would really be my luck though, that like I just did this whole thing and then you guys can't even see it. I mean, I already got interrupted by the freaking jackhammer. I think the jackhammering stopped. Nope. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna dust away some of this powder, make sure everything is blended. I spoke too soon about the jackhammering. All right, and then do I have that even here? Yeah. I'm gonna use the Wet n Wild contouring palette and just the brightening shade and kind of put that underneath my eyes a little bit. And down here. That is such a good brightening powder for under $5. I love it. Okay, and then I'm gonna do my lip. Oh no, my nude eyeliner from Lorac. That is done. I think I'm gonna hit the tips of my eyelashes with a little mascara. Just cause they, they like get powder on them from me putting powder underneath my eyes. They get a little powdery. Oh, I love these eyelash extensions this time. They're so good. Okay. They're so full and like fluffy. I love it. All right, and then for lips, I'm just going to use my Maybelline liquid lipstick. These liquid lipsticks are like out of this world amazing. They stayed with me through all day of camp, of eating and drinking. They stayed with me through shrimp scampi pasta with like oil and white wine and like all that stuff. It is so good. It's the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink. This is in the shade Seductress, number 65. It's so pretty. It's just like a nice everyday lip color, but the formula is amazing. I can't really see my lip line. Hopefully I'm doing it right. Feels right. Okay. I'm gonna add a little lip liner to it. Just to give a little bit more definition and then highlight and I'm done. This is literally like my whole everyday makeup. It all fits in this bag, it's pretty amazing. This is Ofra Rodeo Drive. Just a pretty gold highlight. Okay. All right. I'm gonna spray my face one more time. Oh my gosh, I hate when the setting spray does that. It like sprays big droplets and then it ruins your makeup. Like you're totally doing the opposite of what I need you to do here, fam. It's 10.25, that is a 20 minute makeup look in the car. Quick, easy, pulled together. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you learned, I don't know. I hope you realize you can do your makeup kind of anywhere. Um, if you have a mirror and you have your makeup, you can do it anywhere. But I love you guys all so much and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.